Hi, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to set Chromium to run on Wayland by default instead of X Wayland. You can check if an application is running on X Wayland using either XLS clients or XIs. XLS clients will list all the applications running under X Wayland, and XIs, if you move the cursor over a window and it's running under X Wayland, the eyes will move. If it's running under Wayland, they won't. So what I'm going to do is show you how to set Chromium up to use Wayland by default instead of X Wayland, just by um, running this little video. So let me just get back to the beginning here. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is run XLS clients, and this is going to list all the applications running under X Wayland that are actually open. So as you can see in the video, uh, Chromium is open, so I'm going to run XLS clients. And what you'll see there is Chrome is listed. Now I'm going to run XIs. And as you can see, as I'm moving the cursor over both the terminal and Chromium, the eyes are moving. And what that means is both of those applications are running under X Wayland. So now what I'm going to do is open up Chrome colon slash slash flags in Chromium. And what I'm going to do is search for Wayland. And what I'm going to do here is under preferred ozone platform, I'm going to change it from default to auto. What you'll see here is a little button saying relaunch. Don't click that because what that will do is that will relaunch Chromium back into X Wayland. What you need to do is just close the window. So don't click the relaunch button, just close the window. So close the window. Restart Chromium. And we're going to run XLS, XLS clients again. And you'll see that it's no longer listed. Chromium, Chrome is no longer listed. If I now run XIs and move the uh, cursor, you'll see it moves over the terminal, but not over Chromium. So that's showing you that the terminal is running under X Wayland, but Chromium is one is running natively as a Wayland application. So basically the steps, if I just come across to my notes here. So all you need to do is open Chromium and in the URL bar, paste in the following URL, which is Chrome colon slash slash flags, then search for Wayland and change ozone platform hint to auto so the uh, by by default it's going to be set to default what you want to do is change it to auto there's an option to do um wayland as well um, but i think i read somewhere that the um, preferred way of doing it is just to set it to auto then once you've done that you'll see a big relaunch button at the bottom right of the screen don't click that button because that will just launch Chromium back into X um, Wayland. What you need to do is just close the window um, and then re reopen Chromium and it will be running under X Wayland. So that's all you need to do. It takes less than a minute. Um, paste in Chrome flags, search for Wayland, change ozone hint, ozone platform hint to auto, close the browser, restart, and you're done. So that's how you can set Chromium to um, run on Wayland um, instead of X Wayland. And this was done using, this demo was done using uh, Chromium running as a snap. I believe there is a chromium-flags.conf file, um, but I think that may only apply to Chromium on Arch Linux, but I'm not completely sure. But even if you, after you apply these changes and you do an upgrade, they'll persist. So using this method um, will actually persist in the browser even after an upgrade. So that's all for now and hope that helps.